Okay, now we have to create an anchor link, basically. And anchors are the way that uh, they found to link stuff in between each other. So right now, they just want me to do just one anchor link that takes you to Google. Anchors are like this, anchor, anchor. Remember, open and close. And then you can put inside the href property html tags have property that describes them further like for example this anchor is a tag but i don't close the opening tag yet you know you see here that it's not closed and then i can start adding properties to it like property one equal to something property two so one possible property that i can use on an anchor it's the href property that basically is the hyperlink reference is to where do you want the, the hyperlink to refer to you want to refer in this case to Google because that's what uh, we are being asked for. And then it says that it has to say click me to search in Google. So that goes inside the anchor in between the opening and the closing tag. That's what's going to show up. If we run this, it says click me to search in Google. That is exactly what they want me to, to show. So one thing to mention here is that this is an absolute URL, meaning that it takes to another website, not to my own website. You normally use uh, absolute URLs to take to other websites and then a relative that you don't put HTTP or anything like that to take to your own website. Like for example, if I just say slash Google, I'm saying that I want to take to my own website to the google.com folder, if you can see it like that. Like you can imagine it like that. It's, it's like you're having subfolders in your website and you want to take or to different URLs, but within your same domain name. If you add HTTP, then it's going to try and take it to another domain. 